In this video, I'll show a demo of the Model Context Protocol, or MCP, controlling the Firefox web browser on a Fedora Linux system. Everything in this environment is running locally, and I'm using a combination of open source software and the open source Quinn 2.5 Coder LLM model. I'll show the demo, and then I'll go back and walk through the various components and how they were configured. I'm using the open source Fluho chat interface running locally for this demo. I'll start by entering a query that I'd like to learn more about some Linux distros and ask for Wikipedia articles on five of the top Linux distros to be opened in tabs. Fluho will connect to my Olama server hosting the Quinn 2.5 Coder LLM model and then use an MCP server to give the LLM control over Firefox, which will allow it to open the five tabs. You can see that we have Wikipedia articles open for Manjaro, Arch, Debian, Fedora, and Ubuntu. I already know about Fedora, so I'll ask it to close that tab. And as you can see, that tab closes here in a moment. Next, I'll ask it to open a tab for the browser control MCP GitHub project. This is the MCP server I'm using for this demo. And as you can see, it opened that tab successfully as well. Next, I'll ask it to read through that tab and summarize the example use cases for me. It came back with some additional details and I'm really just looking for the use case info. So I'm gonna rephrase this query and ask for a summary of only those example use cases. And as you can see, it does come back with that example use case information. This MCP is capable of opening and closing tabs, reading the list of open tabs, reading the browser history, and reading the content of tabs. Next, I'll provide some more details on how this was set up. As I mentioned, I'm using the open source Fluho chat interface running locally on this system. I'll go over to the Models tab and then show the configuration for the model I'm using. I'm using the open source Quinn 2.5 Coder 32 billion parameter model served by Olama locally here in my environment. I have the temperature setting for this model set at 0.2. Next, I'll go to the MCP tab and show the configuration for the browser control MCP. Within the Fluho web interface, you can provide a GitHub link to an MCP server and it can clone the repository. And then you walk through some configuration um, to, get the, to get that MCP server configured. I'll switch back over to that GitHub repo for the browser control MCP. And you'll notice at the bottom of the page, it has info on how to configure the required Firefox extension. And as you can see, I do have this extension running in the browser. This is a requirement for this MCP server to be able to control the Firefox web browser. Let's go over to the Flows tab, and you can see that I have a Firefox flow defined. These flows are easy to create. You just drag and drop out the nodes and do some basic configuration and connect the nodes together. I have a start node connected to the Olama Quinn 2.5 node connected to that browser control MCP. And then the final step is over on the chat tab, you select the flow for Firefox and then type in the query. Well, thanks for watching and have a great day.